Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So, Microsoft Edge currently has a tree view for the favorites and bookmarks hub in the browser that lets you collapse and expand your favorites in your different folders. And I mentioned in a video in regards to this a couple of days ago that Google Chrome is also going to be getting a tree view for its uh, bookmarks in the side panel and that video will be linked down below and in the end screen. Now my reason for mentioning this is because currently in the stable version of Microsoft Edge if we head to our history hub you can kind of see things looking quite cluttered and there's no option to collapse or expand any of your timestamps your different days when it comes to the history pertaining to that day. Now this could all be set to change and if we head over to Edge Canary 134 which is the latest preview version and I head to my history hub here we can see a very small yet significant change where there seems to be a tree view that has now become available uh, in this early preview version where you can collapse and expand the different history for that day. So pertaining to that timestamp and the day the history was saved. So there we go. Yesterday I can collapse that, expand that. I can move to Friday, January the 24th. I can collapse, expand that. So you get the idea. And I think this is a very small but significant change. And my reason for saying that is especially if you have a very long browsing history. I think this can tidy up um, things to some extent or the other. Just being able to collapse and expand um, your, those different sections of your history. And at this stage, um, I've only spotted this in Edge Canary on my Windows 10 device and not Windows 11. So it seems to be on a controlled rollout, which is common for these early features um, that Microsoft does start testing. And I don't see why this wouldn't come to the stable version. I think this would be a very nice move in the right direction. And if and when that does happen, obviously, I'll let you guys know. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.